police right now, there's a lot of tension in the air. Actually, the police are kind of redirecting the march, and we're at a standstill now. The protesters are trying to decide if they want to keep marching or if we should listen to the police. The police have been issuing a warning saying that they're going to make arrests soon. So everybody's just try trying to figure out, you know, what's the next move. And Bria, why are you there? What is the most important point you want to make? I'm here because I am a 21-year-old African-American female. I attend the HBCU and my life matters. No one should be murdered in cold blood for doing something innocently and not have to face any penalties. Someone should be held accountable. BRPD should be held accountable. What do you feel about the police? Do you feel that you are more likely to be pulled over, more likely to be hassled if you are African-American? I, I do feel like that is a stigma. African-Americans do get harassed more than Caucasians or any other race for that matter. And I do feel some type of way. I do get a little nervous if I see a police officer in my review as an African-American. I know how to be calm. I know how not to let the situation escalate. But it's always that fear. You know, it's always that feeling of, you know, oh, goodness, I don't want to I don't want to die if I get put over. So when you see a patrol car, a police car in your rear vision mirror, does that does do you begin to feel sort of a panic almost? I wouldn't say a panic, more of a cautious caution. You know, you have to. It's certain rules you have to follow. Otherwise, we've seen it on tape a million times. They will kill you, point blank. Period. And you really feel that? I do. I do. I fear for my brother. I have a brother. He's 24 years old. I fear for him. We, my mom advises him, don't get any, go get any, any altercations with the law because you don't know how it'll end up. We've been warned to stay away from the police and they're supposed to protect us. Murder should not be the solution. Bria, what's all that noise around you? What's going on there now? Um, I'm walking through crowds of people, actually. We're um, standing on Government Street in Baton Rouge. It's just masses of people. The police are trying to control the crowd, but but it's not it's not really working out. It's getting pretty crazy out here. So, so the police are asking you to go home, are they? Or are they trying to turn you around? What are the yeah. police trying to do? The police are trying to get everyone out of here. They're trying to end the march. And are people going to leave? Um, some people are still gathered. A large group of people are gathered, but a lot of people are evacuating the premises. What are you going to do, Bria? I am going home. And why is that? I do not want tear gas in my eyes. 